This is How to Play Chess uh, Part 5. Um, in this part, we're going to uh, develop our strategy to where we can make our first move. We're going to study the center and development, including strategy, nomenclature, and finally, pawn moves and development. Um, so we need to get started here. Um, our strategy uh, consists of three different moves. Number one, develop our pieces. Number two, control the center. And number three, protect the king. If we do all three of those, then we're in pretty good shape. Um, I need to discuss nomenclature. Center is the most restricted group of squares around the center point. D4, E4, D5, and E5. And uh, if I escape the the uh, slideshow here, I maybe will show you this. Um, here's uh, D4 and E4. Here's D5 and E5. And so this group of, of four squares is, is the center, and you generally want to control the center, or at least you know be in position to control the center. But anyway. Be in pretty good sh if you can control the center. Um, you, you haven't necessarily won the game, but you're in pretty good shape. Um, so we start here. Uh, development is, is a strategic march of troops towards the border, and the strategic march of troops equals the strategic march of pieces towards the border. Um, and you discuss the chess point system. Each chess piece has a point value. Um, pawn is worth the least points. Queen has the highest point value of any piece, except the king. And the king, of course, has infinite value because if the, if the king is checkmated, then uh, uh, it's the end of the game. Um, so I actually have a an Excel spreadsheet that uh, um, a spreadsheet anyway that. Uh, it shows the value of each piece. Pawn is is worth one point. A knight is worth three points. Similarly, a bishop is is worth three points. Um, a rook is worth five points, and finally, a queen is worth nine points. So if if uh, if your queen is captured, then that's pretty bad. Uh, it's probably only a matter of time before you you get checkmated. Um, if uh, if you sacrifice a rook for a, a knight or a rook for a bishop. That's not very good. Um, similarly, if you if you sacrifice a knight or a bishop for a pawn, that's not very good. If uh, let's see, so if if you sacrifice a bishop for a knight, or vice versa, a knight for a bishop, then you 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 uh, uh, you broke even, um, but yeah. This is, um, this is the, these are the values of the, of the, of the pieces, and, and you should use these to to evaluate uh, how how well you've, you're doing. Um, so let's see. Um, a pawn move must not be considered in itself a developing move; rather, it is simply a move which helps development. Um, advance without pawns is unsustainable. Advance of other pieces would be repelled quickly. So, um, here's, uh, so it's, it's very easy to see why this is the case. Um, so, obviously, if you, if you develop your pieces before you develop your pawns, if the other, if the opponent advances pawns, then you'll have to retreat, otherwise you're, you're going to get, you're going to have a, a, uh, Either a, a a knight or bishop, a rook or a queen captured, um, and so you really don't want to do that. Um, so now we're, we're at the point where we, we can uh, ponder our first move. Um, remember, uh, we want to develop our pieces, um, protect the center, or control the center, and finally protect the king. So, and, and the easiest way you can do this, and, and you should uh, make every move as if it's the, the best move that you can make. And here, the best move is to advance the pawn two squares. 
um, e7 to e5 and you can see why this uh, so we can see why this is the case um, the you've opened up a a file for the uh, the queen and the and the bishop to break out um, also you're one step closer to castling your king um, and you've protected the center so basically you've 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 you've, you've facilitated developing your pieces you you control the center and you can you're one step closer to castling your king so you you you've uh fulfilled all the all the uh, objectives of the of the of the strategy so yeah this is for anyway that's it for this this uh, video like comment subscribe and again if you found this video as of some use to you then uh consider subscribing to this youtube channel um but that's it for this video and i'll see you in the next video